Hey everyone, so today I got my Carrot Land 2023 merch, so let's take it out of the box and get going. Okay, so I only picked up four things from the Carrot Land merch. Um, everything still was available when I did order, but uh, I was on the fence about a couple things, and honestly, just over the past few years with quality, I kind of like restrained myself. I didn't buy everything that I probably would have bought a couple years ago. Um, but what I did pick up was I got the trading card binder, trading cards, of course, uh, the bong bongy keychain, the plushy keychain, and then the lenticular photo cards. Uh, so first impressions, I'm in love with these boxes, like this one, so cute. I love it. Um, yeah, I've, I'm really happy that they did like the Rose Quartz and Serenity. They brought back Bong Bongy. I know some people had some issue with some of the merch, especially with the Carrot Bong situation. <laughs> um, yeah, which I'll just talk about that real quick. Um, I did not buy the version 3 Carrot Bong. I don't think I will be buying it unless it is overhauled and changed. Uh... I have a lot of issues with the design like a lot of people but honestly the biggest thing especially now because today people have already gotten their carrot bongs and have posted videos and pictures of the real thing like them with it it looks so cheap it looks so poorly made <laughs> like it costs no money to make um never mind the color scheme and everything but um so yeah that's my thoughts on the carrot bong if you have any thoughts on the carrot bong please share them in the comments anyway this merch hopefully it's good i'm going in with low expectations i don't trust the company to make really good merch anymore that's just kind of where i'm at now <laughs> as a fan um but let's see how it goes um let's start with the bong bongi keychain first and then we'll get into the trading card stuff okay so like i said the box is super cute um, I believe this is the same design that the keychain has, just bong bong -y in the pink jumpsuit with like the pom-poms. Um, yeah, just gives you some information about the product. Let's go ahead and check it out. Okay, so here it is. It is a bit different than what I was expecting, honestly. Um, let me take it out of the cellophane. Okay, so his face looks really weird to me. It's kind of like mashed in or like not even across. I don't know, like his face definitely looks a little wonky to me. Um, and then there's like some threads and stuff in his pom-poms. I can probably trim it, but like that white thread shouldn't be there. Um, yeah, not what I was expecting. Also, his feet are misshapen. <laughs> Like, this one's kind of round, and this one's, like, oblong and, like, turned in. Um, he definitely looks smushed. It's, n I don't know. It's not that well made, in my opinion. Um, let me grab the old Japan bung bung e key rings. Hang on. Okay, so I also have the rabbit one. Um, I don't know where I put it. I think I took it out for pictures or something a while ago and put it somewhere else. But these were the ones that were released back in the day. Um... These are so much better in quality. Uh, let me just show you, like it has a little tag that says 17 on it. Just the quality of these is so much nicer in my opinion. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm not impressed by this. <laughs> um, I don't like this big tag on the back either. Um, like I said, these just have like this little, little tag that says Pletus and 17 on it. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I'm kind of on the fence. It's Mine's definitely like misshapen. Like it looks like it was very poorly made. <laughs> and um, I'm assuming like if you bought or you had multiple of these like in a row, they would all look a little different. So yeah, I don't know. Not too impressed. Um, I will say like the jumpsuit's pretty nice. It's like an actual like fabric. So like real clothing and they have like the details of the pockets and things. That is nice. But just in general, I guess I kind of expected more. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so that's the key ring. Um, I still prefer these ones. And I wish they would bring this back. I want like a full animal set. <laughs> okay, next I have the trading card binder. Um, from what I remember, this is much smaller than standard binders. And you can only keep 
two photo cards on each side instead of like having the four page that's why it's like in a much smaller box they did like advertise like you can put four in because you can do them like back to back but i don't know we'll see how that works let me go ahead and take this out of the box I totally forgot that these came with unit photo cards. Um, but let's take a look at the binder first. Let me take it out. Okay, so um, mine is pretty scuffed and dirtied. Again, I'm not, I'm so bad at like showing you guys stuff in the reflection of the light. But like down here, there's a bunch of like scratches and indentations. Like merch was not this bad before. Like things were always so much nicer back in 2017 2018 2019 and i know like a lot of things in the world have changed it's become a lot more difficult to do like manufacturing in asia in particular but i don't think that is like the main cause of this stuff like i think it's the company trying to like cut corners and like not caring about quality of merch because people will buy it anyway and i think that's kind of i said i wasn't going to talk going to talk about it anymore but i think that's kind of what happened with the carrot bong like it looks cheap it looks like they invested no money in it and i'm sure their thought process was well people will still buy it anyway so i'm glad that there was like a boycott for that and hopefully something will be done about it but i don't know um anyway okay <laughs> Ignoring the fact that this is like scratched and has marks all over it. Um, it says 17 in Carrot Land. Oh my gosh, this is just so funky looking. Um, so yeah, it just has two card pages and then... Oh, okay. So there's like a divider between the pages. Um, I'm sorry, like between the sides, I mean. So you can put them back to back and they won't be in the same sleeve. There's actually like four sleeves on one page if that makes sense um so that is nice these look a little bit small i wonder if they will hold japan sized cards let me get some cards to do some testing okay so here i have a japan sized card this is from the dream cards so let's see if this fits no it will not so these will not hold uh, Japan size trading cards, which I feel like is usually the case with um, Korean photo books like for tours and stuff. Usually if you want ones that can fit the Japan cards, you have to get one that was made for a Japan merch line. So that is a bit of a bummer. Um, it really limits what I can put in there. Um, but I do have one from In the Soup, my Juni one. So slides in. And it's like that. And then, like I said, there is another sleeve on the back side for you to put another card. So mine came with 22 pages. So that's 88 cards that you can hold. So that's pretty good, despite its small size. I do wonder how, like, thick it would be, though. <laughs> okay, and then it also has this little card slot so you can slide um, a photo card if you want into the cover. I will definitely not be doing that because there's no plastic cover. So if you put a card in, it's not protected at all. It can get scratched. There's not like a plastic film over the sleeve. Um, but they do give you this little blue serenity card that has the members names on it. And then on the back, it also has the members' names. And on the spine, it says 17. But yeah, I'm just disappointed with how beat up the cover is. It's like really beat up. It looks like I've had this for like two years and it's been like sitting on a shelf and I like regularly took it out and like manhandled it, you know? So that's a bit disappointing. <laughs> Um, but let's look at the unit photo cards. So first I'm checking for scratches. Hip Hop Team has a little mark, but it's okay. Very cute. And performance. Um, I see a little mark, but nothing big, so it's okay. And then focal. Let's see. Theirs looks okay, I don't see anything. And then on the back, it just says 17 in Carrot Land, and then what unit it is. 
Okay, next I'm gonna do the lenticular photo card set. I almost did not buy this. Um, I forget how much it was, but like I know, I think it was um, maybe like 25,000 Korean won. I think it was like just under 2,000 per card, which isn't bad, but um, I don't know. I was on the fence about buying these, but I gave in and decided because I do, I do like collecting photo cards. Um, so let me go ahead and take it out comes in this Rose Quartz and Serenity box. Feels pretty heavy, so I'm expecting these to be kind of thick. Okay, so it looks like they are pretty thick. Um, I think they're maybe the same as like, like uh, Japan trading cards that were lenticular that we used to get back in the day. I don't think they've done them in a while, have they? All right, so we are starting with Coops. Make sure you can see him moving around there. And then on the back, uh, it's just white, 17 and Carrot Land, and then their name. Uh, it is, uh, it's kind of like neoprene -y. It's kind of smooth on the back. I was expecting like cardboard. It feels a bit nicer than cardboard, but I think it is still just cardboard. <laughs> All right, here's Jung Han. Is switching sides. We got Shua. Um, I will say, man, I gotta look at my old <laughs> lenticulars. Like, I'm thinking of like the Japan ones. I think they're from 2019, maybe 2020. I think it was like the first Japan run that was called Home. Um, I don't remember them having all these streaks on the lenticular print of them. Um, I don't, I don't think it's picking up on camera, but like when you move it, you can see like printing streaks on it. And I don't remember that being a thing. Here's June. I really like June's when I saw it on the site. I was like, oh, he's like boxing. Very cool. And we got Hoshi, of course, doing Horonghe. Wanu. Oh, cute. Like him looking up at the sky. I really like that. Uji. <laughs> Just moving his V's up and down. <laughs> cute. Yeah, this one has a lot of like printing streaks. We got Ming Hao. He's, he's doing a hard chicken one. I remember that one was really cute. Very cute. And you. Profile and smiley. Love his long hair. Have you guys seen the Innis free clips? I laugh, but I mean, he looks really good, but the, like him flipping in the air, pretty funny. Ooh, we got serious DK. He's smiling a bit in one, but. I'm so used to seeing him smiling really big. All right, and then we got Singwan. Cute, I like his one with the V. And we have Vernon. V up, V down. And last but not least, we have Dino. So yeah, these, um, I will also say like on the edge, it kind of has those, um, I for I'm forgetting the term, like, you know, on photo cards, it'll have like the little bumps to show like where it was cut from the con other connecting cards. I can feel that on these and they're actually a little bit sharp, I guess, cause it's plasticky from the lenticular. So be careful when you're handling these, I could feel it on some of them, but yeah, uh, those are the lenticular photo cards. Okay, last but certainly not least are the trading card sets. I have not been too happy with the past few runs of trading cards. Um, in previous videos, I noticed a repetitive sorting, like they were sorted by age. And so like I knew exactly who I was going to get in the packs. Um, these were not in like a cellophane bag together. They were just like randomly mixed. So there is a chance that that won't happen this time. Really hoping it doesn't. But yeah, I believe there are 
like 82 cards or something and there's eight in each pack um all i remember is like you wouldn't be able to get a full set anyway because you could only buy 10 packs so that's 80 cards and there was more than 80 cards like i hate when they do that i don't know why they do that if you're gonna make like a limit of 10 packs per person then make it less than 80 cards <laughs> I don't know. Um, anyway, let's just go ahead and get started. As always, I will sort them by age. So these have rounded corners. They look uh, just kind of like album photo cards. Let's see who I got on the front. Ooh, starting off with hip hop. Um, also, I want to say maybe it said something on Weavers that like you get six regular cards and then like two special cards or something like that. But anyway, um, here's hip hop. Glad I got hip hop. Set them to the side. Ooh, and I got Ming Hao. We're off to a good start so far. Um, if you have never watched my videos before, I collect Ming Yu and Ming Hao mostly. So happy to have him. Ooh, we have DK. The spray cans. I haven't been showing the back, I'm sorry. Um, okay, so it looks like they will have different backs. Um, this one has a message to Carrot from the members. Uh, the Hip Hop one, just said Hip Hop team, nothing special. Let's see the DK. Okay, nothing on the DK one. <laughs> Ooh, okay, so here we go. Look at this. <laughs> Ming Hao. DK and Singwan. I'm wondering if there's going to be like the rest of Magne line in here. I guess we'll see. <laughs> um, let's see at the back. This one doesn't say anything either. Oh, see? Yeah. And this one was technically like Mingyu, I guess. Yeah. Ooh, I don't think they mixed them well. Um, <laughs> so this is probably happening again. Um, I do see a couple indentations on some of these okay i got a shua okay we're mixing it up good um yeah i am seeing some indentations but no big scratches so far and june but still this is also these are the special ones maybe no the special ones are the selfie the special ones are the selfie and then like the unit ones i think so these are my two special i don't know i don't know let's see <laughs> And then Hoshi. Yeah, so this is also an age order. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't show you these. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out the pattern. Um, but it looks like there is a pattern this time. So we'll see how that continues. Uh, this is Hoshi with a megaphone and then like one of those light sticks that people use to direct, to direct traffic. Um, so it looks like the only ones that have special backs are the selfie ones. So the selfie ones have a message written by the member and the rest are all just plain. So I'll just show the backs of the selfie ones from here on out. All right, let's see what special one I got to do. Oh, I got another hip hop. Okay, I have Shua's uh, selfie. So there's his message. And then, yep, so these are in age order. So there is, um, they're not like really randomly mixed. So here's June and then Hoshi. And then this next one should be Wanu. Yep. And then this one, it might be mixed up again because it's split part way through. Let's see. Okay, it's not. It's Uji. <laughs> then Ming Hao. Okay, glad I got another Ming Hao. And then DK Dupe. That's so interesting. I haven't been getting, I didn't, it skipped Ming Yu each time. It skipped Ming Yu. I mean, I got the hip hop team one, but that's still weird to me. Okay, let's see. Didn't, oh my God, why are these all hip hop? Oh, that, I feel like this means that I'm not going to get like any Ming Yu. Oh my God. Okay, Hoshi. Oh, she's selfie. There is like a printing air. Oh my God, there's like a whole streak down his face. What on earth? I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but there's like a streak of something on him. Anyway, there's his 
message. Okay, Wanu. Then it should be Uji. Yes. At least they're different cards. That's pretty good. Ming Hao. Different Ming Hao one. That's good. Oh my god, am I not going to get any Mingyu? Is he after DK or something? Like, what is happening? <gasps> what is happening? Why do they keep, keep getting Mingyu? Is it because I'm getting the hip-hop ones? Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Guys, I already saw the top of this one. I got another Ming... Oh my god, I almost said Mingyu. I got another hip-hop. I think I'm not going to get any Mingyu in this whole set. And I also haven't gotten... Coops, Junghan, or Dino. I'm getting like the middle. This is so. Oh. Okay, here is Uji's selfie. There's his message. So then this should be Ming Hao. Okay, I'm getting all the Ming Hao's, which is good. DK, <laughs> Singguan, Vernon, should be Dino. Explain. Explain. This happened last time too. Where are Mingyu, Dino, S. Koop, Jonghan? Where? Where? This is absurd. Are you guys seeing this? This is... This is... I don't even have words. Oh my god, it's another hip-hop. Okay, I have June's selfie, which is really cute. <laughs> okay, so sing one. Shua, Hoshi, Wanu, DK, <laughs> Vernon. So that one I didn't even get a Ming Hao one. And they skipped Uji. I'm so confused. What is going on? Okay, again, I'm gonna burn all of these hip hop ones. <laughs> oh, DK. So, I'm sorry, DK selfie in his message. Shua, June, Hoshi, Wanu, Uji, Minghao. Are you guys seeing this? I have four packs left, so I've opened 48 cards and I've gotten zero as Koops Junghan Mingyu Dino. Explain. Explain to me how this happened. Okay. Oh, finally. <laughs> Vocal. This one also has like marks on it. They're like streaks. It's really weird. Okay, but at least I got a different one. Hoshi's oh, selfie. I already had it. Wanu. Ming Hao cute though. Cute Ming Hao. Oh my god, finally. <laughs> DK. Finally, Dino. And finally, S. Coops. Oh my god, how long was it? Okay, next. Really hoping that I get performance team and then Mingyu selfie. Please. Okay, I don't think I'm going to get performance team. Okay, I got Jungan selfie. Happy about that. He's very cute in this picture. There's his message. Okay, that's a repeat. I don't know if that's a repeat. Ming Hao. Mingyu, okay. At least I'm getting Mingyu now. DK. And Dino, okay. Okay, performance team, vocal team. Yeah, all of these have, like, it almost looks like a fingerprint. And I don't think it's from me. Like, it's not the shape of my finger. And like, there's nothing on my hands. Like, it's really weird. Like, I'm even trying to leave a mark and I am i can't leave a fingerprint mark. Um, I'm, But there's like weird streaks, like someone was touching them. Maybe when they were putting them in the packet. I don't know, I'm just so, ugh. anyway, okay. Okay, Coop's selfie, very cute. There's his message. Okay, Junghan. I think this Hoshi one I have like two or three of. Wanu. Now they're skipping like Uji and Shua. It's really interesting. But I'm happy I'm getting Mingyu finally. And I have quite a few Minghao. 
I have a lot of this DK one. I think I have two or three. Okay, really hoping for Mingyu Selfie. I don't think I'm going to get Performance Team. I think I'm probably going to get Vocal or Hip Hop. But let's see. Yep, okay, Vocal, Mingyu Selfie. Okay, Wano Selfie. So I didn't get Mingyu Selfie. There's his message. That was a new one, though, so that's good. Okay. Thank you. Ooh, I don't think I have this DK one. Dino. Oop. Dino. Coops. And Jungha. Okay, so listen, that started out like really bleak. Um, <laughs> thankfully, I seem to get like two different batches. Um, that might have just been luck. I, there might be people out there who ended up getting only one batch so they didn't get certain numbers. Because I swear, I think I was, I opened six packs and at that point I was still missing four members. I hadn't gotten Jung Han, Koops, Mingyu, or Dino. And that's just crazy to me. Like that, I get that there's an automated process to things like machines need to do things, but it wasn't like this before. Like, so what was Pletus doing before that mixed things so well that like hype is not doing? That's what I want to know. Um, kind of annoyed about this. I feel like out of 10 packs, I should have gotten at least one performance team. <laughs> Um, but at least it wasn't all hip hop, I guess. And as far as who I collect, uh, I got six different Ming Hao's and two doubles of those. And then Mingyu, I think I got four different Mingyu's. Yes. So, um, that's good at least. I'm pretty happy about that. And it didn't look like I had too many dupes, which was nice. Um, that was like catastrophic back in, I think it was 2021 Carrot Land. That was catastrophic. I got like 15 of the same Singlan and Jung Han cards. They're ingrained in my memory. I'll never forget what they look like. I think like I'm at a weird place with merch. I'm, I have like a lot of issues with merch these days and I know I'm not the only one. Um, and I just keep hoping like, maybe it'll be better. Maybe it'll be better. And I mean, like, w this is an improvement from like what I said before with the previous, uh, well, not previous, it was two years ago, Carrot Land, what have you. Um, but I don't like this automated shuffling assortment thing. I don't like it. Um, it takes away the fun. I'm able to like pretty much call out 80% of the time, like, who the next card's going to be. That ruins a lot of the fun, uh, in my opinion. But yeah, did you get any of the Carrot Land merch? What did you think of it? Really glad they used Rose, Quartz, and Serenity. Hope they keep with that. Do I think they will? Probably not. <laughs> um, look at the Carrot Thong. Not going to talk about it anymore, but uh, that does it for this video. Um, until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.